Hurricane Ian made landfall one month ago today, forever changing the landscape of southwest Florida. In the days and weeks since, communities have come together to clean and pick up the pieces of their lives. News Channel 8's Trevor Sahaki joining us live in Venice. Keith, Jen, the destruction around here is very evident, and the debris that's sitting in people's front yards here in Venice is a daily reminder that Ian swept through this town. And some of the people here are still asking questions like, why was my home seemingly saved and others, like this one here, seemingly destroyed at random? I've been down here 31 years, and I've never been so scared in my life. For the people of Venice and southwest Florida, recovery from Hurricane Ian is a month's, if not years-long process. Kitchen, the floor got flooded. Uh, there's all mold and stuff in behind the cabinets. Walter Tressel was staying with a friend during the storm. Today, he was helping clean up his daughter Michelle's mobile home. I'm thinking like maybe a bomb went off or something, you know, in here. Others in Ridgeway Mobile Home Park were overcome with emotion at all the help from outsiders and their own neighbors. Just has seen him walk around made you aware that we were going to be okay. Susan McDowell lost her carport and has a broken window, and she's one of the luckier ones. But just the stuff, it was all over the park. I mean, everywhere you looked was stuff, just people's houses and stuff. Her stuff is sitting out in her front lawn, too. Sarasota County says they are making progress in cleaning up. As a region, we were severely impacted, uh, and, and so it's going to take a while to get things back to normal. Uh, it, you know, and obviously as you go further south, it's going to take longer than here. Officials said they've cleaned up over 1.2 million cubic yards of vegetated debris, equal to 10 years worth of normal yard waste. They've also petitioned FEMA to authorize and accelerate debris collection from private neighborhoods, including manufactured home communities. But in Ridgeway, neighbors are getting the job done. They just walked around the park and helped everybody. It wasn't groups or anything. It was just what needed to be done got done. So, I, I mean, I think we're going to pull through and be okay. And Sarasota County officials tell us that their 311 call center has actually taken over 25,000 calls since the hurricane. Officials also said that they have restored and gotten back up line 176 traffic signals and they have reinstalled nearly 1,000 stop signs. Live in Venice, Trevor Sahaki, 8 on your side.